Hello everyone, today I decided to record a video for you about 11 tips, tricks and hacks in Photoshop. Well, let's get started. Yeah. Like the attention girl, I know you. Know you. Color from outside. It happens that you have a picture from which you want to take color and draw something on the layer. And in fact, you don't have to upload the photo to Photoshop itself. It is enough to reduce the program window. Select the eight drop tool and over over any place on the layer. Press the left mouse button and without releasing it, move the cursor outside the program. This you can take a place from any place on your computer, photo or icons of third party programs. Then go back to the layer and select the brush tool, draw what you need. Text with an image. I have this text, yeah, made it bro, and this beautiful photo. I would like to be inside this text, so how do I do this? Just place the image on top of the text and fills in the entire area. Don't worry, you can then tweak. The image layer and link it to the text by pressing the keyboard shortcut on the screen. Great! You can arrange the image as you like. A flat horizon. It often happens that you make a frame and there is a horizon fill up. You can fix this moment in just a few clicks. Click letter C and click this icon. Then draw a line along our horizon without releasing the mouse button after which Photoshop will automatically align the horizon. Now your photo is even better. Convenient work. It happens that you need to correct some points in the photo with a large magnification, but because your zoom is too much, you don't see what the photo looks like in its original size. To avoid this, I'll show you what you can do. Click Window, Arrange, and new windows. Do we create a duplicate of this document. And everything that happened on the first one happens on the second one. It remains to put them together. To do this, go to Windows, Arrange, to Up Vertical. Now it is much more convenient to work. At the same time, as I said, what happens on one document happens on the second one. However, there is such a moment. When you move through documents via space, you only move on one document. To move through two documents at once, you need to hold down shift plus space. And now you move through two documents at once, without losing details. And so, without shift, with shift. Fast whitening. It happens that you need to whiten an object, whether it is a short or for example a wall. To do this quickly enough, you need to open the black and white adjustment layer. Then select a mask and press Ctrl plus I. The mask turns black. Now select the white color for the brush and select the areas that you want to make white. This is very fast and easy. The rotation of the document. For example, if you need to draw something with a brush, it is not always convenient to draw in the other direction. I would like to rotate the document, and you can do it in just one click. Press the letter R and turn with the left mouse button. This way it will be much easier to draw a counter light or outline. You can also select a certain degree in upper left corner. Three life hacks with layer. I made two adjustment layer here to show the keyboard shortcut for working with layers, and so we create an empty layer to play with. Draw the sun on it. Mm, yeah, that's better. And so, what can we do? All keyboard shortcut will be written on the screen. We can select layers, moving through them. You can also select two or more layers. We can move the layer to another location or move it immediately to the bottom or top. 
Also, if you have created a lot of adjustment layers and you need to quickly see what has changed, you can press this keyboard shortcut on the desired layer and the rest will be dissolved. One click transparency. When you need to reduce or increase the opacity of a layer, you can do this by moving the sliders. But also, this can only be done with numbers. Just select the desired layers, select the move tool and click the desired number. Each digit represents a percentage of opacity. If you need a certain value, you can quickly tap the desired number and the opacity will change. The same situation with the fill, only now you need to hold down shift and do the same action. Everything is very simple and speed up the work. Well, that's all friends. If you like this video, please leave a comment below it. And if you really like it, I will release the second part, which will be very interesting. Thanks for watching. Hug it to myself, hug it to myself, hug it to myself